gems welcome back yes it's Lorena I am back with new hair and new goodies so yes let's just get this out of the way I did recently dye my hair from brunette with highlights to blonde I have never had my hair this light before it is an adjustment but I like it it's been about two weeks since I got it done and it's not quite perfect some of my hair took to the color others part other parts didn't so it is kind of a work in progress but we didn't want to damage it even more by trying again and again so this is what I have for now and I like it I just wish that it was more ashy than coppery it is getting a bit brassy as time goes by I mean it was already a little brassy but it's getting a little too brassy for my tastes but yes this is the newest development in my I don't know beauty world beauty adventures so yes I just wanted to explain that and get it out of the way early on but like I said, this is also about new goodies. I just got my Birch Box Ipsy bag and um, Boxy Charm in the last few days and was like, let's just do an unboxing and introduce my hair in that video. So why not? So let's get into it, why don't we? Because there are quite a few packages here. And as you know, I like to talk too much and I don't want this to be a half hour video. So here's doing good and now let's see if these packages did good too. And I do have my box opener because the boxy charm has some tape so I'm just gonna hand that real quick. Alright so let's start off with the one that I'm usually less excited about and that I did decide to cancel after all and that would be Birch Box. Because I just don't find myself that excited about this. Yes their packaging is adorable. I think this box is actually really cute. I really really like this and unfortunately I cut too far with the box cutter but anyways this is super cute but sometimes the packaging is the best part of this and that's not the point of a subscription so it says what's the occasion um we all have times we want to look extra special whether it's a four-star dinner with your best friends or your standing date tonight this february is about helping you create your own not not quite everyday looks from easy hairstyles Two versatile makeup techniques you can use again and again. So that is the theme for February. Here is the breakdown of products. And then we've got gift of, with purchase. Benefit Cosmetics Lolly Tint Deluxe Mini and Benny Cosmetics Lolly Balm Deluxe Mini with any $35 purchase. So that's interesting. And moving into the actual product. So this is what the box looks like. And in here we've got... A L'Oreal Professional Mythical Mythic Oil Shampoo, Shampooing Nutrition and Brilliance. Okay, shampoo sample. Then they've got a Harvey Prince Hello Body Cream. This says with Sicilian lemon, Spanish mandarin, botanicals, and shea butter. Harvey Prince. I think this is one of those brands that they constantly send you perfume samples of. So that's interesting. Then we've got the La Fresh Nail Polish Remover Acetone Free Compostable and Biodegradable Pad. So, interesting. Then we've got a Aero Revive Cooling Cheek Tint. That could be cool. We've got just more stuff than usual. The Mythic Oil Conditioner in a little package. I don't know how this matches, but okay. I mean, either send two, two of these or send two bottles now. Okay, then we've got Hey Honey Take It Off Exfoliating Honey Peel Off Mask for all skin types. This is cool. I really like peel off masks. I didn't use like peel off masks, but lately I do. And then we've got a Cynthia Rowley Creamy Lip Stain in Heartthrob. And this is minuscule, but you know, purse friendly. So that is our birch box. Is it just me or does it seem like it has more stuff this month? We've got one, two, three with the lip thing for five, six, seven products. Maybe they knew that it was kind of a weird box as well. So that is the Birch Box and yes I did decide after all to cancel that subscription because as you can see I'm pretty much like hmm okay. Pretty much underwhelmed every other month. So moving into Ipsy. Okay, getting this bag opened. I love the bag itself. I saw a picture of it on Facebook and then my sister showed me hers, but I was like, don't show me what's inside. I have an open mind. I want to do an unboxing. And she was like, okay, weirdo, because I don't think she knew I was doing YouTube. But anyways, 
So, love the bag itself. Ipsy continually hits out of the ballpark with just the bag, to be honest. And then inside, first thing we see is a Naked Cosmetics Mica Pigment. And this is in Sierra Nevada. So, shall we open it and see how it... Yes! Why not? Okay, plastic, get off me. So, this is what it looks like. Standard pigment packaging. The kind that you can screw into another one if you needed to make a little stack. Ooh, and it is a nice, like, deep dark brown kind of shade. And it's making a mess because, of course, that's what pigments do. And I would have a white shirt on, but there's a quick swatch of that. Very nice and creamy, but messy, as always, because... That's what pigments are. Big messes waiting to happen. So, that's cool. Not my favorite product. I'll probably handle that, hand that over to a friend, but not bad. Smashbox new photo finish primer oil. Ooh, I've been wanting to try this. So, I'm excited for that. This is yay. Definitely. There's no card with this box? That's weird. Oh, the card was actually in the package. So the card, it says Pretty in Ipsy Pink. That was the theme for this month, by the way. Then we've got three more goodies. We've got a Cella Passionate Pink Lip Pencil. And this is in the shade... The shade, I don't know. Hello Beautiful. I'm hoping that's the shade. I don't know. This is pretty. We shall see. Sorry guys. All right. Technical difficulties today, isn't it? Ooh, that's pretty. Very bright. Very nice for summer spring coming up. Then we've got the Jersey Shore Spa Anti-Aging Lip and Hand Polish in Vanilla Bean. Very nice. And last but not least, we've got a Luxie Flat Definer Brush. Very, very nice. I like these Luxie brushes. I've gotten a couple now, either an Ipsy or BoxyCharm, and I really like them. So, that is everything in the Ipsy bag. And last but not least, BoxyCharm. This is usually the exciting one. I just told my sister, like, you gotta sign up for that. So, we've got Rush to Relax from Stilettos to Slippers. Get ready to work hard and rest easy. That is this month's theme. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six products says, ooh, okay, this first one, Shrey, look as good as you are, this looks like a little postcard, I don't know, package, it's weird, limited edition, sensitive dry skin moisturizing mask, oh, cool, okay, so you open it up like that, interesting, and then you got the mask and, like, explanation of it, there we go, very cool, very cool, so, love masks. So, looking forward to that. Ooh. Okay, and immediately we've got an Ofra Cosmetics. What is this? What is it? Ofra Cosmetics product. And it is Banana Powder Got It. Alright, so banana powder, like, pant, basically. Exciting. Then we've got the Spun Gel You Have My Heart on a String Body Wash Infuse Buffer plus Polish. And this retails... Well, I don't know. Oh yeah, for $15. I forgot to show you the retail price. So the mask is $12, and that is a full size. This is full size. The Ofra... Banana powder is twelve dollars. That's twelve. The face mask is twelve, and then that sponge is fifteen. Then we've got Beauty for Real Coral Crush Plus High Beam Blush and Glow Cream Blush and Luminizer in one. That's what this looks like. This is Beauty for Real Blush and Glow Stick, twenty-four dollar retail price. So let's open this bad boy up. 
can share with you guys. Okay, so it's one of those dual ended packages. Blush on one side. Ooh, creamy. Nice. And then highlighter on the other. I don't know. That highlight's nice, but I don't know if I would use that shade. Interesting. I might give this away. Then we've got Freeze 24-7 Anti-Aging Eye Serum. This, I'm guessing is, yeah, this is a sample size because it's tiny. This is usually, the full size retails for $58. So this is a 7 mil sample size. And then last but not least, we've got Real Tree Eau de Parfum. And this is... Real tree for her, a delightful fragrance with a sweet scent of pomegranate, a hint of persimmon, and an exotic scent of orchids. So this is definitely the travel sprayer size, according to the card. This retails for $12.99. Hmm. Not bad. A little bit baby powderish, very florally, kind of sweet. This is actually my kind of scent, which is rare. I usually hate perfume samples, but this one, so far so good. I know, I'm a weirdo. Interesting, we'll see what my boyfriend thinks. And that is pretty much it, guys. So let me know what you guys got in your boxes. I'd love to hear from you. Let me know if you have tried any of these products and your thoughts down below. I am kind of feeling like some of this was really cool and some of this I'm like, hmm. I might pass that along, but that's what happens with these boxes. You never know what you're going to get. Some months are super, like, yay, awesome, and other months are like, oh, okay, cool. So today is definitely on the latter choice, but, you know, can't win them all. So it's not bad. It's not amazing. It's just kind of like, okay, cool, new stuff to try. Let me know what you got in the box, like I said, down below in the comments. Don't forget to click the like button if you enjoyed this, and subscribe, and stick around for more videos, guys, and I will see you very soon.